Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Taurus. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of March, okay? So this is going to be for the month of March. Now keep in mind that this is being recorded in February. It could resonate now, but I urge you to watch this in March, okay? Um, we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for March? What do we have for March for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What do we have for March? That card just fell out. There we go. What do we have for March? A younger woman. This is the card that fell out. Dealings or relationship with a younger woman. Skull. Hidden secrets that can harm you. Rat. Someone working against you behind your back. Must be this younger woman. This person is jealous. You can tell by the look on their face. Somebody is jealous. They're, they're, they're going to say something. I don't feel like it's true. I don't feel like it's true. I don't. Um... Someone working against you behind your back. You got somebody that's working against you behind your back. Hip, hip, hooray. That's something to be aware of, huh? Um, it is somebody that is younger than you, that is jealous, that wants to win. Um, hmm. Let's get one of these. I don't know where to put this. What do we have for Taurus? Yeah, this younger woman, whoever it is, a rat. Not a good person. Dark energy. It's a weasel kind of thing. Somebody that likes to cause problems. What happens to rats, though? They get caught. They get caught. So you don't have to worry about it. Nobody likes a rat. Nobody. They're dirty. They're gross. They're disgusting. They're sick. Balance. Now this is justice. You may be dealing with some court. You may be dealing with court. You may be dealing with the law this month. But everything is going to turn out as it should. Something is probably going to go in your favor when you get the justice card. That If there's some legal issues that you're dealing with... It's probably going to go in your favor. This is justice being served. This is truth coming out. So whoever you're dealing with, I feel like there's they're going it, to... It's some sort of... I don't know if it's a legal issue or it's a karmic issue. This could be karma. There's some sort of truth that is going to come out. Okay? You're going to get what you deserve in some way. Balance is coming. Uh, that is a card of balance being restored, everything turning out as it should, something going in your favor. Hmm. May have to do with law, may have to do with a karmic situation. This is a final decision as well. One card for Taurus. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. So you may need to retreat. You may want to retreat. You may feel the need to retreat if you haven't already. So uh, it is definitely time to disconnect from the world. I do see like a wedding here. So I'm not sure what is going on with that. Uh, you may di be disconnecting even with another person because there's two people here. Um, you're you're going to be receiving some sort of justice for uh, some sort of... Uh, unfair treatment that you have received. There could be a partnership that is is stepping it up to the next level. Okay, I may see that because this this looks like a marriage to me or a couple. Um, and so there's something that is happening. Balance is about to be restored in your life. You're about to get something that you deserve. You may be spending time with someone that is very special to you. Some of you may be getting a proposal. You could be getting married. You could be uh, planning a wedding, something like that. Um, but there is definitely somebody that is behind you, that is, that is working behind your back. It's like they don't, they're jealous. They don't want to see you happy. Um, so that is something to be aware of.
What do we have for Taurus? You could be dealing with a Libra. I want to say Scorpio. So I don't know if you're dealing with a Scorpio. Or you could also be dealing with a Leo. Um, you definitely have somebody here that is very jealous. Um, this one flying. Oh, four of wands reversed. So I do believe there's a commitment that is stepping it up to the next level, even with it reversed. Okay, I feel like, and this could be extremes, I feel like you're going to be working on a foundation. You may have been in a messy, messy situation, but I feel like it's all coming to an end because justice is an ending of some sort. Star is protection. It is everything happens for a purpose and an offer is coming in with the Knight of Pentacles. There's been some sort of delay. I do believe that you have been hoping and praying for something solid, something stable, something secure. You know, you've been hoping and praying for something. Your wish is going to be granted. You're going to be given an opportunity uh, from somebody, a proposal, an offer, an invite, something from somebody that is very stable, hardworking, responsible, and loyal. Um, could be dealing with an Aquarius. This could be because of the Aquarius energies, you know, that are bringing in, they're bringing you something solid. So you are definitely, definitely going to be getting something of value. You are something that can last. I think that you have passed some sort of test. So your wish is going to be granted. Um, there is, there is a solid opportunity that is coming. I do see you laying a new foundation with somebody by the looks of things or building a foundation or, or a commitment, stepping it up to the next level. Um, but there in and but there is somebody that is against you that you you're, that is in the background that does not want to see your happiness. And I feel I feel like you're going to be dealing with this person this month. They don't want you to be happy for some reason. Um You are protected, though. There is some sort of protection here. You are protected. There's nothing to worry about. Don't lose faith. Something solid, stable is coming. Something that you asked for is coming. And it's it's going to last. This is going to last. I feel like you've been in some sort of commitment or a situation that may have not brought you justice, but justice is coming. Something is coming that is going to rebalance the scales for you. Okay? If it hasn't already, if it hasn't already arrived, um, you're getting a, an offer that, you know, you can take to the bank by the looks of things. Full reversed. Now, the full reversed is, I don't know if there's some unfinished business here. This There could be some unfinished business. This is um, unexpected and need to have faith need to step forward with blind faith, let go of your fears. There's fear of commitment here. You may be fearful of commitment, fearful of marriage, or somebody that you're dealing with is. Um, this is a missed opportunity. I'm not sure if you're receiving an, op an offer from somebody that uh, you may have commit been committed to before. Um, and that could be the case. I do see you spending time alone with somebody. I do. But I see fear. There's definitely fear. Fear of of um, things not working out or something like that. Magician. So this is a yes answer. If and this is yes, justice is being served. Yes, everything is gonna go turn out as it should. Yes, yes, it's going to go in your favor. So the answer is yes. If you are worried about something, there's absolutely nothing to worry about. You have all the power. This is getting what you asked for again. As above, so below, right next to the star card. It feels like there's some sort of prayers or wishes that are that you have manifested. This is manifestation as well. You have manifested some sort of wish fulfillment, okay? This is a time of receiving what you asked for so we're going to be receiving something um it's been a long time coming i think there's and you're going to need to go slow you may need to go slow because of fear whether it's your fears or another person's fears um this is um headed towards success with the magician card somebody's going to be taking action they're going to do whatever it takes to uh show you something Somebody's going to be showing you something, showing you uh, your value, maybe. I don't know. Um, that's what it looks like to me. I mean, the magician does whatever it takes to bring success. This is somebody that is very skilled, very 
masculine energy. Um, this is somebody that is action oriented, that is going to be doing something that is you asked for. So you're going to be getting something that you asked for. It's something solid. It has something to do with a commitment. It does. You're going to be receiving communication as well, if you haven't been, but I, I feel like you, I don't know, it feels like you have been. Um, ooh, there's your communication. This is good news, an offer, a very exciting offer from somebody that is very well suited for you. You're going to be receiving an offer. This person, maybe there may be a little bit of an, an age difference, okay? This person, there could be a little bit of a, you know, age gap, um, I don't know about that. Anyhow, uh, Page of Wands is an exciting, it's an offer or an invite. Um, this person is very attracted to you. Uh, they don't care what you look like, or even though they're very, very attracted. They're attracted, I feel like they're attracted to your physique or your body, you know, or they're attracted to your um, stability or your security or your intelligence or all of it. You know, because this is intelligence, this is stability, and it looks like we have a body here. So whoever is looking at you is very attracted to you, okay? They are definitely very attracted to you, and they have this desire to uh, offer you something. So you're going to be getting an offer this month if you haven't already. Um, this is going in a new direction, uh, taking a new approach. Uh, this is this is this is somebody that is very very confident that uh, doesn't doesn't have any fear. They they see your beauty. I mean, the star card is beauty. This could even be somebody that is spiritual with the magician right next to the card, uh, the knight right next to the star card. There could be a spiritual connection here. Um, wow. You're, anyway, you're going to be receiving an offer or an invite from somebody that is very well suited for you. This is exciting. Um, this person um, is of good character. And I say that because I see this infinity sign right here. That's of good character. Um, hard worker as well. Very, very skilled. Professional. I feel like this person is a professional at whatever they do. Could be a Libra. Could be a Libra. Could be a Gemini. Could be an Aquarius. <laughs> Looks like we, or it could be another earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We also have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Either way, you're going to be getting an offer. You're going to be getting something of value that you asked for. The answer is yes. You wished for it. You asked for it. You manifested it. It is yours. It's yours. And I feel I feel like, uh, you know, there's been an element of unhappiness. We have somebody here that's been unstable or something like that or not happy, you know. But I, I feel like somebody's also acted foolishly. You know, they may have done something reckless. There could be some consequences for that, and I know that's a whole different story, but this is consequences, this is reckless behavior, uh, not, a, not a stable foundation. So I feel like we have somebody here that's not in a stable, or they weren't in a stable foundation. Now they are about to have balance, okay? They're about to, and, and it's interesting because whenever I see this card, I think of the magician because of all the elements on the card. This is, this is definitely getting what you deserve. You're, you're good. The answer is yes whatever it is. Um, you asked for it. You earned it. Your hard work is paying off. Uh, yeah. This is exciting. Like an exciting new adventure, perhaps. Um, you have been hoping for something. Um, and there is some sort of clarity that is coming. There is something that is going to be seen very, very clearly. There's a divine connection to source as well. Um, your thoughts have definitely manifested. They heard your prayers and whatever your prayers were, the answer is yes. Ah, in the past. So I always go past to present. The Ten of Swords in the past. We have somebody here that has acted recklessly. This is reckless behavior. They may have done something uh, stupid. This is acting stupid. Um, and now that's coming to the end, to an end. This is ending a painful situation. This is the end of suffering. There's been a betrayal. There's been uh, 
deception. You know, somebody has been hurt really, really badly by another person, but it is coming to an end. So that is um, a mental or physical collapse, the death of a situation, the end of sufferings. In, a, in some sort of commitment, may have something to do with a family member even. It's over. It's done. It's done. So if you have been suffering or somebody has been making you suffer because of their foolish behavior or their stupidity or their... And it could be a man or a woman. Somebody has been making you suffer. It's over. It is over. I feel like you're going to be connecting with somebody that um, is very uh, faithful, loyal, stable, solid, secure, um, skilled, intelligent, um, exciting. You're, you're definitely getting an offer uh, or an opportunity that you know can last it can really you've manifested it this is this is what you've been hoping for it's over the pain and the suffering are over something is going to turn out in your favor okay um you do have somebody that has been and it's interesting that i put that card over here i never know where i'm going to put the cards i never know i just go with my gut we the, in the past there was somebody that was really 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 trying to hurt you they were they were but I feel like I feel like they're gonna fall flat on their face or they could get caught. This is a fall from power. I think that you've been in a situation that has been really messy, but it's over. And I feel like you're gonna be uh, retreating with another person and, and it could be anybody. It doesn't have to be a lover. Um, a marriage, when you, when you talk of marriage, it is a coming together with somebody, okay? Either way, I do believe that there is some good news arriving. It's very positive, um, very, very positive. You're going to be, you're going to, you're going to be thrilled, Okay. I feel like you are protected. You're protected by the divine. You are protected. I mean, that's what that is. So the answer is yes. It's going to go in your favor. If there is a proposal, the answer is going to be yes. Somebody's going to be giving you something of value. You asked for it, and it's yours. This is definitely the end of a painful situation. You think about the 11 on the justice card. That's manifestation as well. Your hard work, your stability, your security, your loyalty is paying off. Anyway, somebody is going to see your value. They're going to see what you have to offer. And you're going to be glowing. I feel like you're going to be glowing. I feel like you're going to be on top of the world. You're going to be shining. You're going to be so happy. So anyway, um, somebody is going to do whatever it takes. I feel like to show you your value. Good luck.